Hey guys, welcome to this side from Gadget Generations, and today's video is going to be about base lovers. Uh, yes, today I'm going to talk about the uh, HBB Collab IM, which is designed specifically for base lovers that love excellent and super strong base response. I'm talking about Fat Frequency Deuce. Uh, this is a collab IM between Fat Frequency, which is a I guess Singaporean brand with HBB Hawaiian Bad Boy, who is a very famous reviewer and uh, this has been the talk of the town for the past few months because of uh, some bad reasons basically so yeah the pair has been in development since like a uh, few weeks or something like the pre-order started a few months ago but uh, the delivery timeline was getting delayed again and again and uh, i guess the fat frequency was overwhelmed with the, all the orders that they had got for this im well these are considered to be base cannons with 25 decibels of boost into the sub base region at the time of this review the pair retails for about 22990 indian rupees uh, which is the starting point in uh, india which uh, which is available on headphones on market uh, headphones on marketplace so yeah starting point because it has two variants the 3.5m variant is priced at 22990 the 4.4m terminated variant is priced at 24990 in the international market their cost is 238 dollars and 258 dollars respectively I would like to thank Travel Well Extended YouTube channel person Mr Vikas is a very good friend of mine and he kindly lent me his unit of deuce this is his purchased unit that he purchased for the purpose of review so I just wanted to audition it and he kindly lent me his unit for the purpose of review so yeah thank you so much man well without wasting any more time we will begin because today is going to be a quick review for the deuce I have spent like 10 days with the set uh, I actually planned to play, shoot this video last weekend but uh, due to bad health I was not able to first of all i would like to talk about the design and build quality part the pair is quite uh, looks quite decent it has entire uh, shells made up of entirely resin material and the pair sits quite comfortably into my ears as well providing me with good uh, uh, no, uh, isolation and comfort i don't find any kind of issues i have been using these generic ear tips generic silicone ear tips so no issues in terms of fit or isolation about the design the pair has a bit of eye catchy factor to them with the, this textured kind of pattern onto the face covers with fat frequency logo on to the right side and hbb logo on to the left side good comfort everything is good although i must add that uh, the stock accessories are pretty lame with the i i'm sorry for the bad language but yeah you know we get this case with it it hardly stores the iems and it would have been better if they have not included a case <laughs> so yeah drivability uh reduce uh, takes a bit of power i would recommend using a good quality deck amp i have been using it with my mojo 2 uh, i have also tried it with my btr 17 and with my r82 so uh, with the btr 17 i could feel that yes despite having so much power I feel I need to push the volume to the higher side considering other IEMs like for demanding IEMs on BTR 17 I am usually at 20 to 25 volume out of 60 on high gain mode and this is where I put the uh, deuce as well in terms of uh, drivability so yeah, it takes a bit of extra juice and it is all rewarding in terms of sound if you ask me which we will be discussing now so sound quality part uh base lovers you are going to love this IEM because base is all over the place the base on to the deuce is so cleanly uh, powerful and impactful that uh, the sub bass rumble when uh, you listen to some uh, bass centric tracks like bad guy billy irish you will feel your chest pumping up with all the rumbling uh, all that thunderous rumbling that is going around on to the song so very strong sub bass presence and then mid bass has a good punch good speed and good weight to it as well it feels quite meaty and rich in its presentation complementing the other frequencies now coming to the next section the mid range i would like to appreciate the tuning onto the deuce why because despite having such strong bass response the pair maintains very clean presentation into the mid range section if you listen to a track which which doesn't have a lot of bass you won't feel any kind of you know gets overwhelming when we listen to some bass centric tracks so the pair maintains very clean mid range the vocals they stand out with good clarity with no noticeable muddiness yes they get a bit of warmth with the all the strong bass response a bit of warmth is there but there is no muddiness there is no 
नो वेलनेस टू द मिड रेंज बिकॉज द मिड रेंज साउंड सो क्लियर एंड क्रिस्प द वोकल स्टैंड आउट क्वाइट ब्यूटीफुल ऑन टू द सेट बोथ मेल एंड फीमेल वोकल्स एंड आई लव हाउ बेस कॉम्प्लीमेंट्स द वोकल्स विद गुड कैरेक्टर एंड गुड वेट टू दैम बोथ मेल एंड फीमेल वोकल्स साउंड सिंपली अमेजिंग ऑन टू दिस सेट ट्रेबल ट्रेबल इज क्वाइट राउंडेड आई वुड से इट इज नॉट एक्सटेंडेड आई वुड से दैट द main attraction for the deuce is lies in its bass response especially into the sub bass section with that strong presence now onto the technicalities part the stage is also quite good it is quite, it has executes quite a good stage you can feel it to be open and big in its presentation it extends well into the sides like giving you a really nice uh, headroom and then the depth is also quite good so you get a quite 3d presentation onto the stage i would say instrument separation imaging and layering and quite decent for the price point i won't call them to be spectacular or um, uh, or call the deuce to be a detail monster but it uh, produce decent level details to, so that you don't feel any kind of lacking so in my opinion deuce is designed specifically for people who love bass who love that uh, thunderous and rumbling sensation with quick and punchy presentation into the mid bass for bass lovers this set is going to be a delight to listen to for uh, tracks like EDM hip hop this is going to be a spectacular set to own i on the other hand uh, don't like this much level of bass so for me it gets a little bit of overwhelming when i listen to some hip hop on to this set like after 30 to 45 minutes i feel like i'm done with today's listening session so this is not my signature that i personally enjoy i would say that but again i am going to repeat myself for bass lovers this set is uh, probably end game at a really good price point for 25000 you are getting a really end game level sound in terms of bass lovers Well that's about the fat frequency deuce from my side. I would like to again thank you Tra Mr. Vikas from Travel Well Extended for lending me his unit of deuce for the purpose of this review. I hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video. If you have any questions related to the deuce, you can ask me in the comment section below. Some people might consider why I did not I did a comparison for the deuce. Basically, I would say that deuce has a different signature which is quite different from other IEMs in its price point that are the pool and will the performer 5 plus 2 and uh, uh, i have a bunch more but i personally feel like deuce signature doesn't align with any of them deuce is designed for a different breed of people who like that bass so yeah that's why there is no comparison in today's video well that's it i hope you guys enjoyed watching video for today's video for the fat frequency seduce don't forget to leave me a like on this video and if you are new to the channel consider subscribing as i regularly make content related to high fi audio related gear including iems usb decams and more so stay tuned with me onto this channel that's polgit signing off thank you so much